number of minority vendors at Folsom Field is growing, and you'll get to experience the added variety starting tonight at CU's first home game of the season. Your reporter, Justin Adams, a proud alum, visited some of the university's 13 new vendors this year. It's almost time for kickoff, and there's nothing better than good food as well as being able to watch some football. And if you're going to come here at Boulder, make sure that you come to Dwayne Field, where today you'll be able to see some of the new local vendors. Get this. According to the University of Colorado, more than 60% of the vendors that are going to be here are minority-owned, and one comes from Park Hill, and it brings a little bit of that southern charm. Take a look at this. As Mississippi Boy Catfish and Ribs is located in the Holly Market market in Denver. CU Denver alum Ty Allen owns the licensed nonprofit restaurant and performing arts center and now he's taking his menu to Boulder for game days. You can find his food truck and you know what? It's going to be tremendous right here at the Fan Fest area. Oh man, we got red beans and rice, we got gumbo, greens, yams, um, catfish, okra, uh, uh, pulled pork, brisket. Uh, there's about 10 items on the, on the menu, man. So, uh, you know, don't get me to line. This is all going to be good, yeah. <laughs> now that you have some soul food, how about getting some of that soul flavor? Candace Knight owns Soul Flavor, and she serves Korean recipes mixed with a touch of soul food. And it's all about the food that she grew up eating from her mom. And she is happy to bring a piece of home to Folsom Field. Getting people to experience something brand new and hopefully they can enjoy it like a piece of our home can be enjoyed by them and yeah I think that'll be valuable if they can just get a taste of our flavors and enjoy it in a place that they probably can't really get it in Boulder so yeah that means a lot. You can find both of these businesses right here on Duane Field is all going to open up at three o'clock and kickoff is at six o'clock. In Boulder I'm your reporter Justin Adams covering Colorado First.